Well, let me get it. This is actually called Opie. He is a big, he's, he's a meat guy. He does a lot of meat. So this is actually a cow. And on the other side of the fence are uh, poppy plants. And this poor cow, while grazing, had a few poppy plants. And consequently always leans over the fence to eat more poppies. And that's why he has a hole in his bell there and cuts about his body. So he's a, kind of an opium addict. Yeah, unfortunately. You know, once the cow falls off the, the trailer, it's, it's all over. This is actually a print of the painting I gave to Mark Ryden, and thanks for what he does. Great guy. Great guy. I got a photo of him. And got it. it was funny when we were at the show, um, me and him actually wore the same suits, not knowing the red velvet suits, black shirts, red ties, and we look so much alike. You want to see a picture of me and him? Yeah. Yeah. The people have called him uh, my father. I'm like, uh, he's an illustrator as well. That's why I think what's going on in Long Island and juxtaposed is wonderful because illustrators weren't artists, photographers weren't artists, video guys weren't artists. But recently it's becoming that tattoos are art, pinstriping is art, uh, garbage pail kids, those illustrators, Mark Ryden, he, he made the jump from illustrator to painter, which is just a beautiful thing. He's broken the ice and haters will hate, the guy's talented. But this is me and Mark. And do you not see the the, the, uh, the resemblance here? I mean, that's dad. I still send him Father's Day cards. <laughs> that's pretty funny. It seems that he's really uh, enthused by the whole by the whole uh, situation, the synchronicity of it. Yeah, he. They were teasing us. Some celebrities were in the crowd, and uh, you know, teasing how how much we looked alike. I've never seen a picture of him actually. I've, he doesn't uh, look anything like this guy. He's got long hair, big throat. 